I'm Karen Thompson and um, I'm a textile artist and I've been working with the Silver Spoon Collective for coming up to three years now. I've created um, the Medicine Spoon Memorial which is to honour um, all the women that were persecuted um, in the witch hunts in the UK um, and there's roughly you know 4,000 names in the memorial. I, I hold their pain and no I'm not alone I've climbed Pendle Hill many times and as a child was sort of told about the Pendle witches as, as just wi uh, women literally on broomsticks and I actually thought they lived up there. I thought they lived on top of the hill. Um, and doing this work has just made me realise that so many people are told these stories about witches and they're seen as these sort of caricatures and you know, they were women. They were real women that were really poor and struggling um, and were persecuted. And it's, it, it, I think when you start to understand that and realize how many women were persecuted, it's actually, it's, it's horrific. It's horrific. And I think it's just really sort of brushed over in our society, in our, in our history lessons. I mean, it's absolutely fantastic to have the memorial here and the reason is we've got the most incredible hamlet of buildings that are dedicated to the stories of Pendle and the, the local history of the area and to actually make this connection with the memorial and the story of I Am Witch to our hamlet here is the most incredible collaboration. So we're bringing together women, families, ancestors that have a connection with the bricks and mortar, the heritage and the history that we have in the Northwest and importantly to Barraford and Pendle.